Chapters on fish, ancient Greece. Anyone know anything about that? Oh, oh, fish, ancient Greece was when a bunch of dudes wore togas to show off their swag. Uh huh. And they lived like a million years ago. And Baldwin hung out with him because he's so old. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Oh, uh, class dismissed. <laughs> so, did Mr. Baldwin seem a little like off today? Yeah, he didn't even notice when Milo ordered takeout. Oh, I forgot. I left my dumpling back in class. I'll catch up with you two later. <clears throat> uh, so, uh, hi there. I was wondering if you'd like to get some food sometime. Oh, to eat. Because I, I noticed you like to eat a lot because I've been watching you. Ha, ha, ha. What am I doing? Mr. Bowler! Get out of here! Oh. Did you just ask out Miss Bonesy? What? No, I didn't ask out Miss Bonesy. Well, you were asking somebody out. <gasps> Is there a ghost in here? I wasn't asking anybody out, Milo. I was practicing asking somebody out. Ooh, so who's the lucky lady? None of your business. You can tell me. Oh, Baldwin. <laughs> Look, I'll tell you, but it's a secret. You can't tell anyone. <laughs> All right, come on. There. Uh, uh, oh, bats. Oh, I guess I'll have to call the janitor. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. You like Miss Lips. Hey, when you get married, will you change your name to Mr. Miss Lips? What is wrong with you? I just said this was a secret. Dude, if you like her, why don't you just ask her out? Because if I really did ask her out, she'd more than likely, almost certainly, reject me. But that hasn't happened yet, so I still have hope. It's what gets me through the day. And that's why you have to keep this a secret. Because if she ever finds out, my life will be over! Well, well, not really. But you know what I'm saying. Don't worry, Mr. B. Your secret is safe with me. <sighs> and now back to sometimes I'm a werewolf and sometimes I'm not. Hey, who's been drinking out of the toilet bowl? Oh. Hey, it was the werewolf. Hey, Milo. What's up? Secret? <laughs> I don't know any secrets. <laughs> no way, Jose. Oh, he's definitely hiding something. You think? Not, not a, nothing. Oh, come on, Milo. What is it? I said I don't know anything and I told Bob that I wouldn't tell. <gasps> you have dirt on Baldwin? Milo, everyone knows best friends don't keep secrets from each other. In fact, Mr. Baldwin probably told you whatever he told you because he wanted me and Oscar to find out. I'm not sure that makes any sense. Shut up, Oscar. <laughs> oh, what have a mega crush on Miss Lips? Whoa. Oh, my God. That is too adorable. So when is Baldwin going to tell her? Never because he doesn't want to get rejected. <laughs> what? Why would she reject him? They're perfect for each other. They're both single and old. And they're both old. Well, if he's not going to tell her, then we should tell her. No! <laughs> B, you can't tell Miss Lips anything. It'll kill Baldwin. Uh, I'm sorry, B, but I have to side with Milo on this. If you like someone, you don't tell them. You wait and hope that something just happens. You just wait. I, I gotta go. This is love, and you can't keep that secret. I think there should be as many people in love as possible getting together all the time, always. No. No. I promised Mr. Baldwin I wouldn't tell anyone. No, you can't tell anyone either. I won't tell anyone. Sheesh. Hmm, Bet, are you watching this? Koi's finally going to talk to that boy she's been in love with forever. Girl got the digits. Oh, 
I could never do that. Oh, I love it when people like each other and then they get together. <sighs> What's with the fuss? I just know about this person who likes this other person, but he won't tell her. Names. I promised I wouldn't tell. It's so stupid. But I never promised that if someone guessed, I couldn't tell them that they're right. Is it that Evan likes me? What? No. Oh. Well, is it that Davey likes me? No. Oh, well, is it that Connor likes me? Kimberly, it's not about you. Okay, okay. I'll give you a hint. It's one of our teachers. Mr. Baldwin likes Miss Lips. How did you know? They're both old. <laughs> wow, this is big blues. I think that internet should know about this. Guacamole! Baldwin and Miss Lips! <laughs> Welcome to your self-esteem and you. Now, good self-esteem can be as simple as giving yourself a compliment like, Hey, I look all right today. Or, I don't think they're laughing at me. Uh, Ms. Lips, if you were giving Mr. Baldwin a compliment, what would you say? Well, I'd tell him he has a, a giant nice forehead. She said she likes his forehead. <laughs> oh, well, aren't we a chatty bunch? All right, next I want to talk about... Oh, ma. <laughs> Baldwin plus lips. Well, uh, I never was good at math. <laughs> now, another way to have good self-esteem is just lie to yourself. Uh, uh, hey, I just got a call saying you need to borrow some chalk. Hey, Baldwin, next time, why don't you try bringing the lady flowers? <laughs> hey! Milo, what the heck was going on back there? I don't want to upset you, but uh, pretty much everyone knows about your secret. What? I did that that's not good! Oh, my goodness. I can't believe this is happening. No, no, it, it, it's okay. Ms. Lips still doesn't realize you like her. And you, you know how she's a little... Uh, she she never, you know, figures it out. Hello, B is going to tell Ms. Lips everything. <laughs> I tried to stop her, but she said... Ugh, this is not happening fast enough. Oh, I know. I'll write an anonymous letter to Ms. Lips explaining that Baldwin loves her and take it to her house. You promised you wouldn't tell. Well, technically, I'm not telling. The letter is. So, did I do? And then she smelled nice. And then, and then she left. Oh, my gosh. We have to stop B from getting to Ms. Lips' house. Milo, how exactly does a pregnant male seahorse and his sidekick chase down a healthy girl? Bye, bye, Simone! Wait, Milo, just be careful. <laughs> Would you like to get coffee with me sometime? No, thank you. No? Well, it's just that coffee gives me the queasies. But I do like Mexican food. Oh, oh yeah, sure. Let's get Mexican food sometime. Oh, that sounds wonderful. Well, goodbye. She said yes. I can't believe she said yes. Well, B, I hope you learned that you can't just go around telling other people's secrets. Are you kidding me? Look how happy he is. If I've learned anything, it's that I am right about everything all the time. Oh. Hey, Mouse, we ought to get the band back together. Wait, we never had a band. Sure we did. I played the drums and you played guitar. But I like to hit things. Are you sure I wasn't the drums? Oh, that's right. I used to sing. Okay, yeah. It's all coming back to me. Girl, why do we ever break?
break up. La, 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 Now I remember. The reunion tour is off. <laughs>